Hey y'all, welcome back to another video. So in today's video, um, we are going to be doing a unboxing because I purchased this mop off of Amazon. Um, so I'm going to be doing a review as well as um, pretty much like a first impression and I'm going to also do a little demo for you guys. Um, but I wanted to come on here because I just wanted to put out there a little disclaimer before I even get started that this video is not sponsored with Amazon or the company of the mop. I purchased this with my own money. So these are my true honest opinions of this mop. So I just want to put that out there. And so yeah, so if this is something that you would like to watch, then continue watching. Bye. Thanks guys. All right. So I'm just going to go ahead and use my scissors to unbox this. this in there so it looks like this you know if you can you guys can see it so it's in another box a box inside another box okay this is called a um, magic hands-free flat mop and bucket so it looks like this before I destroy this box it's like the dimension of the mop bucket as well as the mop and it says that it's a simple clean quick wiping um, patent design hands-free dry wet preparation durable lightweight storage and friendly material so I'm also going to be showing you um, like I said I'm gonna show you a demo of the mop so it says no damage to tile or wood Oh, pretty. I'm loving the color on this. Kind of matches my nails, huh? Okay. Here is the mop head. really soft I am um, actually liking it it feels like it's good quality it feels really um, thick okay so it has um, the openings here press on this like I don't know if you guys can see it We're going to put these in here. So I'm gonna just go like this, twist it, and you can actually feel it's getting tighter. And I'm guessing this one goes like that. Twist it as well. Lefty loosey, tidy righty. So you want to turn right. And then twist it and there you go ah so looks like this i'll show you guys in a minute it also looks sizable looks pretty um big in there i'm just going to fill it up with water and then here it says dry and then this one it says wash seeing that I was struggling to do the dry part of the mop um, it seemed like this kept coming off but I had to take a minute and go back to maybe I was doing something wrong and obviously of course I was and I just wanted to show you guys real quick so um, that way you won't struggle so when you take this off and when you want to put it back on it has these little pockets here if you guys can see that there's like three little pockets as well as the three um, I don't know what you call this but it's supposed to slide in the pockets and I didn't do that when I was showing it to you before um, that you can remove it and so when you want to throw it in the wash 
but when you want to put it back on there what you want to do is make sure that these slide into the pocket slide it in and then just easily place it down and that's it so let's give it a try to see if now it um i don't have any problems with it okay so i have And I have syrup. As you know, syrup can be really sticky. Now I'm gonna test it out. from the box um, it didn't come with instructions which was okay because the mop wasn't too hard to um, pretty much put it together um, the only thing was you just kind of pop it on here and that is it and everything else just goes um, attached it's pretty much like common sense so um, I like that how easy it was to assemble I didn't need my husband to help me or anything like that which I actually absolutely love um, that I can do it myself and I love that it came out in this color I like how it matches my nails I can uh, I just love that so it's like a mint color um, I love also this how it's just really soft to hold on to it kind of feels like foam or something um, I I actually liked it when I was uh, mopping um, it just feels something soft and sturdy to hold on to um, and not like give us kind of like calluses or anything on our hands but I just like that um, it was just nice to work with and as well as a little hole here so we can hang it I like it because um, usually I would keep my mop outside but this time I can just keep my mop inside and just hang it so that way my rabbit doesn't be nibbling on the bottom of the mop head so speaking of mop head um, I like that one came attached to it as well as three other ones that were in the box but when you are ordering your mop um, it gives you options to order just two of the mop heads or you can order four like I did and they even have I think six so you might get a better deal with the six one um, but so yeah so it came with four and I like how you can um, just easily take it off you can take it off so you can put it into the wash when they are, you know, good and dirty. You can just throw them in there and yeah. So I like how we have three, like I said. Um, okay, so that's another thing now that since it's moving around. Um, I loved how when I was mopping, it kind of moved around to um, the edges and things like that. So it was like really, it was working with me, not against me. So I really love that. Um, especially because like around the chairs and things like that I don't have to keep like moving them around but it just kind of swirls around you guys like it's really super easy and uh, I just loved how it was just easy to use like I don't know how else to um, put it into this review but um, but yeah so now enough with the the mop um, so now moving on to the bucket okay now the bucket um, 
I absolutely love the color. Again, I can't get enough of it. I'm actually excited for the color. I didn't even know we can have an option of choosing our color for the bucket, but um, apparently there are other colors. I'm gonna color, like, it's so beautiful. I love it. But it makes me so happy and like excited and ready to mop. <laughs> That's mom life for you if you're like so happy to mop. Um, but um, so, and then here into the slots on the wash. Um, side on which is this side it has teeth in front and that's the side that you're gonna be placing your your this side of the the mop where you're gonna put it in there and then you can just dunk it in there for like I did it like maybe three to four times depending how dirty your mop is because this is the clean part and then the dry side is where you're gonna put the mop in to supposedly dry it now I want to talk about the dry part because I was expecting for it to be like really dry I mean when you say dry to me I'm thinking okay it's not wet at all but when I put it in the dry part it was like semi wet like for instance this one um, I just took it out the dry side so when I rub through here you guys can see how it's it's still kind of wet I don't know if you guys can see it but it's still kind of wet and um, I don't know that was kind of tricky to me so I guess my expectations was too high on the dry side of the bucket but to be honest, I'm not mad at it because when I was mopping, my floors dried super duper fast compared to my old mop that I used before, which is like the old school mop. Um, and I hated that when I would mop, I would have to tell my family, don't come over here, it's wet. Or stay over there, it's wet. Or you know, like, and they would have to wait almost like 45 minutes for my floor to dry. But with this one, I used it and I swear like, within like five minutes my floors were already dry so I'm loving that and I can't wait to share with my family so that way you know if they I'm mopping one day in the kitchen and they want to come and get a snack or a drink or something like that they can because my floor is dry like I don't have to worry about them slipping or falling or anything like that um, so that's what maybe that's what the dry part means like it's gonna give you a semi wet um, part of the mop which is gonna dry your floor super fast and so it could just be that, I don't know, but I'm absolutely in love with that part that it just dried my floor so fast. And um, as well as, I was gonna say something. Oh, the top, I don't know if you guys can see it from here, but right here you can tell where I lined it up, how much water I put. I might've put too much water in here, but the top, it kept popping off. So I don't know if it's because um, I put too much water, so I'm just going to play around with it some more to see if um, the top will stay in place because actually it has like um, you see I didn't even have to struggle too much but it's like th these two attached here and then this hole here they go onto the side here so it's supposed to be like this right but um, so yeah so I don't know I'm gonna try to see with less water to see if it'll stay in place instead of just um, when I would answer my mop, it kept popping off. So um, I'm just gonna see if that helps to put less water in here. Um, but so yeah. Um, and then of course it has a handle too, so you can pick it up, which I didn't really like too much because I'm so used to my um, industrial mop where I, ha if you see my cleaning videos, you've seen my uh, mop bucket that I was using before and it's just pretty much an in industrial mop and that one actually rolled and i didn't like that this one we can't roll it but i'm thinking of doing a my own uh, diy which at home depot they have like these rollers that you can just simply i would that's how i'm gonna do it but i'm going to add rollers to it um so that way i can roll it instead of having to pick it up because i don't want to strain myself or hurt my back or anything like that but um, maybe it'll be less heavier if I put less water as well. So we'll see. I'm still going to play around with it, but I'm absolutely in love with this mop, you guys. I'm so happy to um, use this, that my floors are drying so duper fast and um, things like that. So um, if you want to purchase it, you can get it on Amazon. Um, it depends the, on the price range because I've been going back and forth on the prices to see um, if anything's changed and right now currently it's unavailable. I don't know if it's just for the color the color, or it's just the, simply the whole mop, but um, you can purchase it on Amazon if you're interested in it. 
again, this is not sponsored, you guys. So, um, but um, I did pay for it. I think it was $45 for this, but that was because I ordered more of these. So um, you have that option to order just two, maybe one, if they even have up to six of these. Um, but yeah, so um, I think that is it. So I'm just going to rate it. I think I want to give it a an eight, maybe nine. I don't know. I'm really happy about it. I don't want to give it like a perfect 10 because I'm not sure yet. I still want to play around with it. I just didn't like that it kept popping off, but it might just be my bad. You know, it's my fault that um, I overfilled it. But um, so yeah, so I think I'm going to give it an eight and a half um, just because I loved everything about it. I loved how it dried my floors um, super fast. I just liked the satisfying apps. That's another thing. I. Uh, I was satisfied with the cleaning, how when it was dirty, um, I would insert it into the wet side and then um, put it in the dry side. And you can see it with your own eyes, how it was like cleaning it and drying it. Like it was squeezing all that dirt and musk and caca off of them. <laughs> but I just liked how satisfying it was. I love the color. Um, I really don't have anything bad to say about it. I'm, I'm, I actually like it. so. I would suggest and sorry for the dogs you guys um, but yeah but I would recommend that you guys try it out for yourself and see how you like it so this is pretty much the end of my video I hope you guys enjoyed it and if you did please give me a big thumbs up subscribe if you haven't already and I'll see you guys on my next one bye Mwah. thanks guys